Hey everybody, welcome to another class. What we're going to do today is we're going to work on an intermediate vocabulary lesson with different things in the grocery store. So that'll be the lesson for today. It should be nice and easy, nice and smooth, so feel free to join the class uh, and then work on some vocabulary as we also work through a few sentences and talk about the words as well. Hey, Ahmad, Ahmed, Ahmed. Okay, good, good, good. Welcome, to, welcome to class. Welcome to class. Glad to have you here. Can you um, can you turn up your microphone a little bit? Can you increase the volume of your microphone? Your microphone. Can you increase the volume of your microphone? It's okay. Just uh, just to. I can hear you, okay? It's just hard to hear you. It's okay. No problem, okay? Is this your first class on Verbal? No, you can hear me. Yes, I can hear you. See, yeah. Perfect, perfect. All right. Is this your first class? Yes. Okay, good. Well, welcome to class. You really like Verbling. It's a great place to learn English. What we're going to do right now is we're going to work on vocabulary and so forth. Uh, where are you from? I'm from Sudan. Sudan, okay, good. Good, good. Good, welcome again. Okay, and let's see. Uh, Miguel, Miguel Leal. Hi, good night. Hey, how are you? And you want to say uh, good evening, okay? So what happens is when you first see somebody at night, you say good good evening, and then when you leave, you tell them good night or have a good night, okay? okay. All right. good evening. <laughs> good evening. Where are you from, Miguel? I'm from Spain, Valencia. Oh, okay, good, good, good. Fantastic, fantastic. <laughs> Uh, Vincenzo, hey, I, I had you in Hi. class before, right? Right? Uh, you were one of my classes? No. no? No, 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 never, never. Never? I'm, okay. This is the first time in uh, Berlin. Uh, pardon me, there was another Vincenzo the other day, and it's just not a name uh, I'm used to. I think so. Why. He's another okay. Vincenzo, yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe there's a guy walking around using your name. You ought to find him. <laughs> what are you using my name for? I'm the only Vincenzo. <laughs> no, you stop it. So, um, Vincenzo, uh, where are you from? Uh, I'm from Italy. Okay, good, good, good. Fantastic. Okay. Welcome, welcome to class. Here. Welcome to class. And same, thank you, same, thank you. You're welcome. You're most welcome. Same thing like I said to Ahmed. I mean, this is a real great, this is a great place to continue practicing okay. your English. You know, just I look hope at, uh, to... I hope to learning and uh, improve my English. Yep. Uh, well, I'm a, I'm a beginner. Yep. No. Well, you 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 say you're a beginner. You sound like maybe beginner to intermediate though. But that's good. That's good. That's, okay. that's like the Thank perfect you, level. Teacher. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. <laughs> um, trust me, I, I know absolute beginners. Hey, oh, Slim. Okay. What's up, hey, Slim? Teacher. Hey, good welcome good back. Evening. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening, <laughs> Slim. Come. Good. What's going on today? Everything going well? Happy life? Not so bad. Not, Not so, bad. so bad. Yeah. Not so bad. It's, it's kind of good when it's that way. Sometimes if it's going too well, it's just like, oh, it's another great day. I say, good, good, good. So let me say hi to Sun. Hello, Sun. Hello. Good evening, everyone. Hey. hey how are you? Good uh, today. Good. How's, how are things at Georgia Tech? Everything fine? Everything fine, <laughs> no. Lots, lots of work, though, huh? Lots of school work. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, keep it up. Keep it up. Good to see you. Glad, glad you could join my class. All right. Thank and, you. And uh, hey, uh, Salha, Salha. <laughs> Hi. Hey, welcome back. Hi, teacher. Welcome Thank back. You. How Thank do you, you. How do you, how do you like that last cl last class? Do you like the pet peeves? How you know yeah, what pet peeves was, are? It was very interesting, but I don't have enough time to to listen to, to all the class because I have a small baby and <laughs> oh okay yes. how old you how old your baby yes he's uh, he's sleeping now good 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 is your baby like two months old three months old five months how, no. how old is your baby uh, she's uh, three years 
Three years old? Okay, good, 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 good. So good. You're starting to walk around, take everything. Yeah, yeah. You, know? <laughs> you gotta you gotta and lock up all the cabinets, right? You know? Yes, and if you didn't you just, like to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so that's good. That's good. Well good. Well it, it, did you say it's a son or a daughter? A daughter. Daughter, okay. Daughter. They, yeah, they say that they say that girls the best ages are age three to thirteen. Those are like the best because they just, I'm serious, I kid you not, guys that I know that have had daughters, they said it's the best time because, you know, they, they, they love you so much, you're so sweet and everything, you know, and they're, they're, they're at the age where they start walking around. Once they hit 13, though, wow, they hate you. You know, you're the worst person in the world. So. Yes, and I'm studying and uh, they didn't uh, let me study. <laughs> they don't let you do anything. Well, well, well I'm, I'm glad you have a nice, beautiful daughter. We'll, we'll, we'll get you some time in, in this class, okay? Let me, uh, okay. let me let me say hi to one more person. That, that's nice stuff, though. I, I always like hearing about things like that. Okay. okay. You're welcome, Sebastian. Hi. Hello. Hey. How are you? Good. 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 Welcome back to class. So good. Thank you. Good. 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 All right. Just, and you've been you've been in a few of my classes, right? Yeah, in a couple. Yeah, okay. Like all right. Yeah, sometimes I forget. I'm getting so old. I don't know. I don't know if you see all this white hair. You know, I'm getting all this white hair and stuff. I'm like, no, we have to. We have an old yeah. you know. <laughs> you know, pretty pretty soon yeah, I'm gonna be like an old folks home, you know, drinking <laughs> drinking my food out of a straw. You know, talking. <laughs> I remember the old days when I used to be a teacher. I remember what it was like, yeah, like all senile. But um, but anyway, this isn't this is <laughs> this is an intermediate class. I'm gonna slow down a little bit. I'm also gonna mellow out a little bit. Um, drink way too much green tea. Did I? Hey, uh, by the way, Tom, a son. Uh, yeah, Tom. Did I tell you that I get uh, that I get my green tea from uh, Hangzhou? I ever tell you that? No, I get that, maybe. Yeah, yeah. So no, I'm serious. I get uh, I get it straight from Hangzhou. And no, if you guys, exactly. <laughs> yeah, Dragon Well Tea. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, what we're gonna do here? This is an intermediate class. I'm gonna I'm gonna slow down a little bit too. Okay, as far as how fast I talk. What we're going to do is we're going to talk about words that you would use in a grocery store. All right. I like to use a lot of pictures. Okay. Okay. We had this last one here. How cute. Uh, uh, sorry, teacher. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to share? Can the link? you? Can you? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yep. I forgot all about that. And also, uh -huh. too, I do try to share these before class, meaning underneath where the class is. Sometimes I forget. And by the way, Vincenzo, it's okay. You're new to class. Let me help you out with something, Vincenzo. You you rightfully are looking at for the link. So do you see? Yes. I'm looking you for have the the reg it's okay. Do you see where you have the regular chat? Do you also have a verbling button there? Uh, no. Click oh, you don't. I can see. Yeah. No, okay. I don't. Yeah. Let me. I'll share it with you in the regular chat. Okay. So no problem. But let me show you something because you want to get used to this as well. Okay. okay. Again, I. And again, I understand you're new, so no problem. Ah, uh, I see now. Sorry, teacher, okay. I see now the link. Okay, and do you see? Okay. Oh no, I just added the link. But what I want to show you is something else, okay? And it's no problem. So if you look here on the left, okay, I can see oh, that okay. you guys are in this chat. This thing here, this verb link, if it didn't load this time, it's an extra app, okay? Just an extra application. And it'll be here if you can see my screen on the left hand side. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, so good, good, good. Because you'll want to be in that chat. That's where I printed it. That's why I pushed it in here. And then I recognize that you and Miguel and Salha are up here. And you want to be in here. But it's okay, folks. Okay? Just next class, try to get down in there. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. You know, I wish there was some way, like even during a screenshot, you could just hide my face. I don't know why I have problems with that. <laughs> so yeah, so these are things in grocery stores, okay? Grocery stores. When you look at these, keep in mind, okay, some of these are phrasal verbs, different things like that. Some of these are nouns that are a combination. Um, some of these are just nouns that they put an article in front of it, okay, that you can take a look at. So keep in mind if it's a verb, noun, adjective, idiom, whatever the case. Because some words can take on different, well, a lot of words can actually take on different forms. 
It can be a noun, it can be a verb, maybe it can be an adjective if you slightly change it. So make sure that you're using the right type. What we do in my classes, it might be painful, all right, but you learn is somebody reads the word or the phrase, then they read the definition, and then I pick somebody else randomly to give a sentence. So every word you should be thinking of a new sentence because I might call on you to give an example. And again, that, that is just, I'm not trying to be cool. But it makes you think of the right word. That's what I really care about. Uh, Ahmed, go ahead. Yeah. To Bill, go ahead. Okay. Uh, actually, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. It's okay. This don't is worry. the first time. I'm... Yeah, but don't don't worry. Okay, don't worry. I I was actually the first. I kid you not. The first time I taught class online, I was petrified. I was like, what am I going to do? I said, I said, kid you not, because I was teaching, right? And it, it was a, it was it was in a different environment. It was just a four time when these people at once, and I, I was surprised they didn't give me any practice, and I was I was so scared. So don't worry, don't worry. We all we all get like that. Okay, it's part of. Okay, the, now, yeah, go ahead. Okay, now what am I supposed to do? Yeah, just read. So you have to bill and just read that it's a verb, and then read the definition. That's it. Okay, a bill. I uh, know um, here. It's okay. Just read this for me. Mm -hmm. Okay, to build a verb to send a request for payment. Okay, so that's good. So that's a verb. Okay, and we know it's to send a request for payment. Okay, and let me give you a visual. So a bill, all right. So here's a bill. So when you bill somebody, okay. Oops, that's that's a bill too. Okay, so bill, like pay your bill. Bill Gates. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Bill Gates. Not Bill Clinton. <laughs> yeah, not Bill. Clinton. Actually, you know, Bill Clinton was an all right dude. You know? <laughs> he was. Uh, he was. That came a lot better than Bush. You know, he, he didn't want to okay. go blow things up. So, um, so yeah, this is a bill. And to bill somebody, this is if you're in business, if you have a service that you do for somebody, then you send them a bill. That's to bill somebody, and your accountants. The accountants are the ones who do the bills, so accountant. Okay. Uh, sorry, teacher. Mm -hmm. Yep, go ahead. When we, f when we finish to have a dinner or a lunch, uh, we, we could, we could uh, request you get a bill. A bill. Mm -hmm. okay. yep, that's when you request a bill as well. Um, and some people say request a bill, and they also say request a check as well. Ah, or bill or check. It's the same bill thing. Check. Yeah, yeah, even, yep, exactly. Some people just say um, to request a check. Some people say, can I get my bill, please? Either way is fine. Okay. Yep. So, Thank you. You're welcome. So let's continue here. So um, to bill, uh, Slim, hey, Slim, can you use to bill Hi. in a sentence, please? Yes. I have asked the um, factory about uh, to give me a bill about the compressor. Say that again. I have I asked. asked it. Mm -hmm. I asked uh, a man, a factory manager, to bill uh, to give me a bill, the bill of the compass. Yeah, but so that's to give me a bill. So if you look at that, that's the second one, a bill. That's like a request oh, for payment. Yeah. But no, it's okay, Slim. So you could your your sentence is correct, except that you would say that you asked him to bill the company for the goods. Okay, all right. But don't worry, you're close. We're I will wrong. try. Yep. Yep. Can I try again? You sure can. Go ahead. I, can I? Uh, I bill uh, a factory manager uh, for buying uh, a compressor. I bill the factory manager for, I would just say, yeah, for buying the compressor. Yep. Okay. So good. Good, good. Um, so, okay. So let's continue here. And I see Rami. Uh, yeah, Rami, this is nothing to do with Skype. This is a whole other way to improve English, okay? So um, Skype is, Skype's for little kids. I'm just kidding. I use Skype. But this is different, Rami. Just kind of watch as we go along. Um, uh, join. Us. Sorry, guys. One second.
Okay, so let me uh, let me continue on here. Um, and by the way, if anyone has a sentence and they want to share it, feel free to. Okay, it's all right. And if we don't get through the whole list, I don't mind. All right, so it's no problem. Um, Miguel, Miguel, the yes. next one here, a bill, a bill. Okay, a bill, uh, a request for payment. Request for payment. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. And let's see in here, uh, uh, Salha. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. A bill. Can you a use bill, that? For example, when we when we are in a restaurant and we finish eating, we ask a waiter for a bill. Mm -hmm. Yep. You ask the waiter for a bill. Got it. Got it. Okay. It's so. Mm -hmm. Yep. Go uh, ahead, Miguel. Yes, I have a question. Is it correct to say, uh, please, uh, can I pay the bill? Or? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, yes, uh, to the waiter. Uh, uh, please, can I pay the bill? Mm -hmm. And another, another form to say this, uh, how, how can I say in another similar form? Or? Um, well, what we were talking about earlier, like with, um, like with Vincenzo, it's like when you request a bill, you say, yes. can I have the bill, please? Can I please have the check? Yep. It's all the same thing. All right. And when you when you say, when you say can I pay the bill, you might not even know how much the bill is. You just ask. Ah, uh, okay. Yep. So that's that's what you're wondering there. Okay. And hello, uh, Hassan. Hi, Hassan. Uh, hello, like everybody. Hey, how are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Good, good. Welcome back to class. Okay. Thanks. Yep. Good. Nice to have you back. Um, so, Hassam, can you read what's on the screen here to come out? Can you read that and then read the definition? To come to. Mm -hmm. Yep. To equal an amount of money uh, to add up to. Uh, to, to uh, Okay, to equal an amount of money to add up to, right? Okay, well, good, good, good. Wow, this is the first. Hey, a hey, um, Hassam Gang Gangnam, make sure you're not banging around things too much. Make sure you're not moving too much because when you do that, it hits your microphone. It makes them sound okay. All right, I know you don't mean to, but that's what it does. <coughs> Hello, Hassam Handy, uh, Hassam Hamdi. Hey, welcome back, welcome back. So good, good. You're welcome. Uh, Tom, can you use, oh. can you use to come to in a sentence? Oh, yeah, the to come to. Okay. Yeah. So it's like when you when you when you uh, also to come to is like this to come to a conclusion. Conclusion. Okay. Yeah. So sometimes we talk about to come to. When you're trying to figure out a solution to a problem, oh, you know, we're going to come to a, so, a, a solution. It's good. It, it's uh, it to come to find fifty dollars. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. My total, uh, and you can say my total came to. All right. Yeah. My total came to. It came to a conclusion as well. Okay. So good. good oh, good. yeah. Okay. Yep. To come to, it came to. All right, so let's continue on here. Um, let's see um, where I'm all over the place. Uh, Miguel, can you read the next one to deduct? Yes. Uh, to take away, subtract an amount of money. Okay, so good, good, good. Vincenzo, can you use to deduct? And don't worry, you can, also, you can also change it, right? Like you could say, um, it did, uh, I used my ATM at the grocery store. $15 was deducted. Okay? So uh, oh, okay. Is an amount of money. Okay, okay, okay. I understand. Um, oh, it's, uh, it's a little difficult for me. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, do you, do you use your credit card? Yes, I use credit card, yes. 
So just so think about to deduct in that. Like if you have a bank account, you need to pay your credit card. Think about deduct or to deduct. Um, mm. I need help. Sorry. It's, no, it's okay. It's no problem. I mean, you're you're here in English class because you want help. Okay. It's not a problem. Don't don't apologize for it. So like this, let me help you. So. I had to pay my, just repeat after me, I had to pay my credit card this month. Uh -huh. No, just, just repeat after me. Uh, I had to I, pay my credit card, I had to pay my credit card this month. I have to pay my credit card this month. So I needed. So I needed. To deduct. To deduct. $50 from my checking account. $50 from my checking account. Okay, so you see how that? Mm -hmm. Yep, no problem, guys. All right. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Good. You're welcome. And uh, and I, I like to teach others, you know, because I, I myself I learned a little bit of Spanish and a little bit of Chinese, not not really enough, so I know what it's like to learn another language. Um, Hasam Hasam Handy Hamdi, hi Hasam Handy. Teacher. Teacher, how are you? Good, good, good. Oh, I'm sorry, one second. Slim, I will deduct your allowance. Yep, that one works. Very good, Slim. And you're welcome. You're welcome. And uh, Hassam Hamdi, can you read the next one to discount? Okay, teacher. <laughs> discount to reduce or lower the cost of product. Mm -hmm. A product. Yep. So let me show you this here. It's easier to see this. So this is when they lower things, right? Okay. Fifty percent off, thirty percent off. So if something is a hot hundred dollars, and they give you a seventy percent discount. It's only thirty dollars. Okay. All right. Yeah. It's kind of like uh, discount for the product. Yeah, to take off the price. Um, uh, yeah. Ahmed, can you use yeah. to discount? Can you use yeah. to count a uh, sentence? Make sure you use it as a verb. Don't use it as I got a discount. You want to make it to discount. You know? Okay. Right. To discount. Okay. <laughs> what can I say? Good, Slim. I see yours. Um, and you want to say of the. Is, is Soldi uh, Slim? Is that like a product or something? Yes. What? Um, I was just looking at Slim's. So the mall discounted, I would say the mall discounted 50% off the price. You know, off okay. the price. Yep, 50% okay. off the price. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh, Ahmed. Go ahead. Okay. It just came to me. <laughs> it's okay. Do you ever shop? Do you ever go shopping? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, do you ever ask somebody f to lower their price? Yeah, to discount. <laughs> yeah. So you ask somebody, right? You ask them yeah. to lower your price. Okay. So go ahead, use that in a sentence. When you do that action, you're 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 uh, performing to discount. Go ahead, Ahmed. Create a sentence yeah. using that. I'm sorry, I can't do it. It's okay. Why not just just repeat after me? Yesterday I was shopping. Yesterday I was shopping. And I asked the store clerk. And I asked the store clerk. To discount the sweater. To discount the sweater. By twenty percent. Like twenty percent. Mm -hmm. Yep. So good. To discount. Okay. Uh, sorry, you said you said ask what? Ask what? Ask, ask her to discount. Ask, ask her, her to discount. Okay. discount. Now, if you asked her for a discount, then you get into the next one, which is a noun. So that's the actual one. Okay. All right. So look, guys, 
this is this is how words. I know I know it's a little confusing, but this is how words can take on different meaning. Or pardon me, yeah, different definitions and also yes, different meanings. Even though they're all doing dealing with um, you know costing less money. One here is a verb, so this is an action. I'm going to discount the normal price off of this car. Okay. This car has a discount of 50%. All right? Mm -hmm. That car um, um, is a dis. Oh, shoot. Uh, yeah, so in here, so a. Um, so in here, once you get into a uh, once you get into an adverb, all right, or pardon me, a adjective, right? So in here, costing less money. So the discounted car, okay, the discounted car, all right, mm -hmm. is where you get into that because it's no longer at the same price, okay? All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's see in here. So let's go on to the next one because I can see that's a little, little uh, confusing, but that's okay. Um, okay, so let's see. We kind of swapped around because we had new people in here. Uh, Slim, can you read the next one here? Until to put the in, to put in information in the planning to write in. To write in. in yeah. Yep. So this is when somebody you know um, record the books. Let me see. Yeah. So this is an example here. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah. So when somebody's recording information, when they have to write it in, okay, that's to enter to put in information electronically or to write in information. So now what we do is we record this, you know, we record information, what, like a spreadsheet, for instance? You know? Otherwise, we have different forms, okay, that we can put information in, right? Okay. Hey, yeah, and I'll send you a link of these words, uh, Sidra. There we go. By the way, Sidra, you can always find, almost always find the links for the classes underneath where the teacher lists the class, okay? So um, uh, let's see who's next. Uh, let's see here. So uh, Hassam uh, Gan Ganam. Hassam Ganam. Yeah. Can you do me a favor? Can you use to enter in a sentence? Okay. Like you see here, uh, this definition? Yesterday, when I was in the store, in the store, I saw the salesman uh, uh, in, uh, enter the, the the price of my jacket of my new jacket. Yeah, very good, very good, very good. Okay, so we'll on, we'll go on to the next one. Okay, Tom, can you read this next one to issue? To issue, to optionally give auto or uh, print. Mm -hmm. Yep, to give out our print. All right, uh, stop, stop, huh? Yes. Can you do to issue? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you can, like, and by the way, you can issue somebody a receipt. So, a receipt, for instance. The same, no? The same? Maybe? It's okay. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this, okay? All right. So to officially give out or print, to issue, like you issue a receipt, for example, you can issue stocks and bonds to shareholders. Can you use to issue in a sentence? To issue, maybe it means, means it's a sense. To what? To send. Um, to issue, like to send somebody like a notice or something, like to issue a notice. You know, you, you can do that as well. Okay, but like you usually, what it's talking about here is issue a receipt. You know, like Slim says in the airport, I issue my ticket from the printer. Okay, and um, 
rely of notice to some employees, for example? I'm sorry, say that again? Do you have to rely, rely of notice to some, to some employees? I am sorry, for, for some reason it's so difficult to hear you. So you're talking yeah. about employees? Yes. So rely when, of... No, it's okay. It's okay. Rely of, rely of. She mean rely of. Rely of notice to some uh, employees. Oh, like to, issue, to, issue, to issue a layoff? Yeah, I'm sorry. You have to issue a layoff. Like to lay off employees? Yep, you can issue a layoff. Okay, so good. Good, you got it. Okay, and let's see here. Um, I think uh, Vincenzo, can you read the next yes. one? Hack. Uh, okay, hack to pack. Uh, to put things into a grocery bag. To put things into a box to move. To put things into a suitcase to take with you. Okay, yep, this is to pack, to pack something that, okay. And okay. Uh, Miguel, can you use to pack in a sentence, please? Um, uh, I know I need to pack my my shoes for my travel or for... Yep, yep I need to pack, you, you want to pack your shoes in your suitcase, right? Yes. Pack suitcase, so... Because you're going on a trip. What, what trip are you going to? Where are you going? Are you going someplace nice? Uh, no, I'm just kidding with you. Uh, <laughs> it's okay. So good. Good, good. Okay. So let's go on to the next uh, one. Uh, can I ask uh, a question, please? Uh, you go ahead. Uh, what's the difference between when I, when I want to say to go another country is to travel or to trip or well yeah you're, what you're going to do is I'm going to take a trip to another country I'm going to travel there uh, okay, okay. Uh, so if I want to to say I'm going I'm I'm going to to travel to New York or to yeah, I'm going, you can say I'm going to take a trip to New York hey. Okay. Yeah, and then trip is a noun, right? Because that's what you're taking. Yes. Or I'm going to travel to New York, and travel is a verb. Ah, okay. Go okay. somewhere. Mm -hmm. Thank so you. So it just depends on how you want to say that. Sort of. It just depends on how you want to say. It. Either way is fine. Either okay. way. Is fine. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. So this is an idiom here. The next one here is an idiom. Um, uh, Ahmed, can you give me the next yes. one here? Uh, press for time. Uh, in a hurry. Yep, yep. So this is an idiom. You're not really pressed. Nobody's really um, you know, pushing on you, but you're pressed for time. Can somebody, let's see, let's see who can do this here. Uh, go ahead, Vincenzo. Can you use pressed for time in a sentence? Pressed for time. Um, my my train uh, is going. Uh, I'm in. I'm. Uh, my my train is going in a hurry. It's so, correct. So your train. So maybe your train is late. Is. You can say my train is late. I'm. Pressed for time to ah, okay. get to work. Mm -hmm. uh, can you repeat? My train is. My train is late. Late. And, okay. Yeah, and now I'm pressed for time to get okay, to work. Okay. 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 I understand. Yep. Good. 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 Okay. So here, um, Hassam uh, Ganam, the next one, to swipe. To swipe, uh, to put a card through uh, computer, computers, computers, computerized machine, computer, computerized uh, machine quickly so it can scan the, the information. We usually uh, use this word with ATM cards, uh, credit cards, debit cards. Uh, Identification cards, 
Yeah, yeah just yeah. Yeah, so you swipe it through these machines, right? Everybody's familiar. Well, not everybody, but most people are familiar with that. Okay, just swipe. Let's see here. One second. Screen's kind of slowing down. Okay. Um, can you guys still hear me? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. just uh, just went slow. Yes. Yeah, no, it's not showing me everybody's name. Uh, Tom, can you use yeah. to swipe, can you use to swipe in a sentence, please? Uh, <clears throat> the sailor asked him to swipe the car. So, uh, uh, pay for it. Asked him to swipe the card to pay for pay it. Pay for the good. Mm hmm. Yep, got it, got it. Okay, and then let's uh, let's continue on here. Okay. And to verify, to verify is the next one here. Okay. okay, good. Okay, it looks like things are getting better here. One second, let me let me see if ay ay ay. And give me one moment here. I want to see if I can close some of this. What's um, going on, Tisha? It's okay. Just my... Uh I think you can talk one by one. <laughs> welcome back. I think you welcome back. <laughs> yeah, it's back. <laughs> we have a new student, guys. You have a new student. Yeah. Where, where's the teacher? <laughs> I don't see a teacher. <laughs> Nurse. Hassan is a teacher. No. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mess. It's a mess. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we'll continue. Um, okay, so good. So to verify, to verify, I forgot who we left last left off with. I think it was maybe Miguel. Miguel, can you read yes. to verify, please? Yes, to make sure that something is true. So this is this is just in general as well. You know, like to verify information. But what you see. Uh, as well as sometimes you have to verify a person's credit card. Sometimes you need to verify that the person is who they it's say like, they are. It's like confirmation. Like information. Um, permission? No, verify is not permission. Okay, verify. No, no, no. no, no. It's, it's okay. Let me let me let me finish you real quick. So okay. verify isn't so much asking permission. It's to make sure that what you're saying is correct. So if you're using a credit card, they're going to ask you for like your passport or your identification just to verify. Okay. You might be. We can asking, also. What's that? What's that, Sala? We can also verify what is um, in the bill. Yeah, you can verify the bill. Very good point. So what you can do is you can look at the bill. You know, so like a um, uh, like a restaurant. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can verify what's on there. All right, you can also have a grocery store receipt. You can look on there to make sure that nobody has overcharged you 
or charge me. <laughs> yes. Right. And, and, okay. and, and it's 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 crazy. Um, like in the United States, I didn't really look at my bill too much. Uh, when I lived in Singapore, everybody looks at their bill at a restaurant, and the reason why is they always not not always, but a lot of times <laughs> they'll charge you for extra right. items. Yeah, it's oh, like really? it's like a game. Yeah, I just kid you not, it's like a game, and nobody um people just get used to it, so they just verify. Really weird stuff. Really weird stuff. Okay. 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 Um, and in here, yeah, you know what? The screens here are so small. Um, in here, it's kind of hard to do this. Let's uh. Yeah, well, let, let's try this anyway, okay? Let's, um, let's see if we can fill in the gaps. And this one here, this is the vocabulary. Okay, mm -hmm. okay so let's read this, okay? Um, and I'll start here. Uh, uh, Salha, can you read this for me, please? Uh, all right. Uh, that's... Mm -hmm. What do you What do you guys think in here? And I'll, I'll copy and paste this so that we have these later. Okay. Did that? That comes to. Yes. <coughs> yep. Comes to. All right. I think it's more sweet. Yeah, because that's the total. It comes to. Okay. Do you have one of our steer membership cards? All right. Okay. And then read the ne read the next line here, uh, Saha. All right, that comes to twenty twenty dollars seventy five. Mm -hmm. Do you have one of our star membership cards? Okay, read the next line. What is that? It's a free yeah. card which allows. No, no, no that's okay. Have... Just, just, just the next line. I'm gonna have Slim. Thank, thank you, though. Okay. Slim, read the next one. Okay. It's a free card which allows our customers to receive special discount. You uh, simply need to fill out our membership application form. Well, okay. I should, I should yep. use the discount because it seems okay. Yep, it gives money off, okay? Go ahead, Tom. Next one, Tom. Next one. No. I'm a later. Uh. So remember, she doesn't, she can't. It looks like she just doesn't have enough time. Yes. Uh, no, thank you. Um, I later press the okay. full time. Uh huh. Okay. Go ahead. Read read the next um. Yeah, read the next two lines. Oh, how will you be paying for that? Will that be cash or credit? I think I'll pay with my card. Okay. okay. So good. Good, good. Um, Vincenzo, can you read the, yes. next, can you read the next two lines? Uh, 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 from OK? Yep, OK. OK, is that a credit card or a debit card? I'm sorry, I don't understand your question. What is the difference? A credit card? Mm -hmm. Yep. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Credit card, uh, yeah. So I, I put the words in the side, but let's take a look. A credit card. Yeah, yeah okay. Mm -hmm. uh, a credit card. Uh, yeah. So look, look at the word. Yeah. A credit you card. Swift. Um, what's that? Swift, I think. Swift. Bill? Yeah, bills you once a month. Mm -hmm. Swift, Swift. Say that again. Bills. Bills, Swift. yep. Okay, yeah. a credit card bills you once a month. Mm -hmm. A mm -hmm. debit card mm -hmm. deducts the money directly from your bank account. Yep, so good. Good, good. Okay. Okay, and then let's see. Go ahead, uh, Ahmed. Go ahead, read the next one up here. Well, this is an ATM card. Mm -hmm. Remember, guys, all the words are issued? in that. Yes. Issued you. Uh, issued by my bank. Good. 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 Uh, it's connected to my bank account. Can I use that? OK. And let's go into the next one. So um, Hassam uh, Ghanem. 
Yeah, uh, sure. That's a kind of uh, dead curves. Place press is a button market, uh, DPT, and uh, <laughs> and in uh, um, swipe yep. and swipe. Yep, and swipe. <laughs> Yep, swipe your card to the machine. Very good, very good. Okay, and um, Miguel, Miguel, the next one. Can you read Sabine, and then the next one? Go ahead. Yes. Uh, okay. And now, what uh, what do I do? Uh, please. Mm. I think it's enter. Mm -hmm. uh, enter your pin number. Uh, the identification number, which uh, verifies your your identity, <coughs> your identity, your identity. Yep, very good, very good. Okay. okay. You. Yep, you're welcome. And um, uh, Salha, go ahead. You read uh the next uh next three. I'm going. Yeah, I'll read the next one. Okay, and now. Can you read the next one, paper or plastic, and then continue on through the cashier? Paper or plastic, I'm sorry. What did you say? I'm doing... Yep, you're welcome. And um, uh, yeah. yeah, so so it's okay. So go, go ahead, uh, Salha. I'm, I'm going to blank your groceries. Okay. So look at this. What kind of bags would you like? So they're going to do what to your groceries? You're going to take them home. I think it's to the pack. Yep, pack. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm going to pack. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Don't worry. As long as you're here learning more, okay? And then, um, okay, so then the last one, plastic, please. So, uh, shocker. Shaker Fauzi, uh, Shaker. So Shaker, you have two windows open. You have the Verbling window open, and you also have your Google Plus Hangout window open. You need to close the Verbling window, okay? All right? Just close the Verbling window, or otherwise you're hearing echoes, you're hearing voices, and voices will drive you crazy. Uh, Antonio. Hello, Antonio Rodriguez. Hello. Welcome to class, Antonio. How are you? <laughs> Hello, Antonio. <laughs> hey, Antonio. Antonio, you, you might have your microphone muted. It's okay. Let me show you, Antonio. The microphone. Hello. Do you hear me? Yes. Hello. Hey, where, where are you from, Antonio? Where Where are you from, Antonio? No. Hello. Yes, Antonio. Hello. Hi. Hi. I can hear you, Antonio. It's it's my first time here, and I I I am a bit uh, lost. Yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry. First thing is breathe. Okay. Just stop for a second. Stop looking around. It's okay. Just stop. It's okay. Just relax. Okay. The computer's not gonna mm -hmm. grab you and rip your head off, okay? So just relax, okay? So all that you're okay. on here right now is you're on a Google Plus Hangout through Verbling, which is a fantastic way to learn English. You'll see on the right-hand side you have the Verbling chat, okay? So you can okay. look over there. That's where we're typing. I'm the teacher. You can't see me right now because I'm sharing my screen. We have a lesson up on the screen. You can see where it says mm -hmm. vocabulary tutorial on the bottom. The way that these classes work is you participate in class. The teacher calls on you. Or sometimes we have what's called a free throw. We just let everybody just kind of talk and talk and talk. And the teacher still facilitates it, okay? It really is that okay. simple. And then all you do is you just look for the different classes on Verbling you'd like to take based upon the lesson type. Some people like certain teachers better than other teachers. 
It's just the way it is. Mo most people prefer um, prefer the pretty teachers. That's why I always put a screen share. So you know, sometimes I change my voice to sound like a female. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, welcome to Verbal. Oh, can you say that verb for me again? I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just the truth. Come on, who wants to look at me compared to looking at uh, at Hina and all these other ones? So it's okay, guys. Don't worry. My feelings aren't hurt. I have thick skin. But yeah, but that's it. That's 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 all there is to it, you know. Um, okay, so here here's some other ones. Okay, so <clears throat> okay, so here's here's another vocabulary follow up. These are great lessons. Okay, so. Okay, go ahead. I'll tell you what, Antonio. Even though you don't know the definition of everything, we'll we'll throw you straight to the fire. Antonio, can you see number one? Can you read this for us? Security <laughs> purposes. Test. Uh, vamos a ver. What are the uh, What are the texts? Uh, I don't. Make sure that down on the bottom ah. you have Brett Tudor click. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Go ahead. For security purpose, you need an identity card to enter the laboratory. Just the car throw this machine on the I don't know, sorry. It's okay. It's you you weren't in the lesson with the vocabulary, so it's all right, okay? If you're here earlier you could probably do it, okay? Um who can help okay. him? What words should be in here? What words should Antonio use? Can I? What's Swipe. that? Swipe. Yep. Okay. So go ahead Antonio, read the read this whole next sentence. Just read that. Go ahead. I must study the the word. Yep. Just. Mm -hmm. yeah, just read the sentence now that you have the word. It's okay. Just swipe the card. Go ahead, read that. Hi, Antonio. Did I lose you already? Mm hmm. I think. Yeah. Can you read the sentence? I think you're actually looking up the word somewhere else. Okay, no problem. Okay, but make sure make sure you're paying attention more to the class than anything else because we'll show you. I'll show you the visual aids. You just came in a little bit later, you know. So we went over this earlier. You're just late to class, and that's okay. And if you saw this earlier, then you would know to use swipe. But again, it's all right. You just came a little late to class. Okay, so good guys, good. Let's see what else we have here. Shocker, Shocker Fauzi. Yeah. Hey, Shocker, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Doing well. Um, can you try to turn up your microphone just a little bit so we can hear you a little bit better? Okay. A little bit more. Okay. Okay. Where Where are you from? I'm from Egypt. Okay, good, good, good. Is that how I pronounce your name, Shocker? It is, that's right, Shocker. Shocker, okay. And yeah, if you can turn your microphone up just a little more, just a little bit more. Yeah, it's just, it's so hard to hear you. And I have, I don't know if you see my ears, but they're, they're really big, but they don't work too well. So yeah, just try to turn up your microphone just a little more, okay? Okay. Okay. Can you read this next one here for us? Can you read number two? Can you see that number two to register your software? You register your software, please. Uh, write your name and address in the box below, and then click next. Okay, and actually you're going to enter, okay, enter. So you write down things in pieces of paper. Usually you enter your name into things on the internet and into okay. software, different forms and everything else, okay? But good, okay. Welcome, welcome to class, okay? Um, okay. Excuse uh, yeah. me, teacher? Yes. Uh, from where you get that, I can get this, uh, this uh, page. Uh-huh, yep. Yeah. Yep, I'll give you the link, okay? And also, too, just keep in mind these class links, they're, um, they're, you'll find them, uh, at least for me, I almost always have my class links directly on the page where the class is, okay? So it should be underneath 
where it has live now. See if you can find the link there, okay? No, no problem, but I'll give them out as well. Okay, let's continue on. So, uh, Salcha, number three, please. I always rest some time too much when I travel. My suitcase is how huge. Um, no, no, it's okay. No. So look at the word two, okay? Look at the word two, all right? So I pack, I blank too much when I travel. I pack, I pack my yep. no problem. I always take. Yep, I always pack too much. Okay, good, good, good. Slim, number four, yes. please. Okay, the policeman check it. Oh, driver lessons. Oh, I don't think. To, oh, we can say. The first man check it out. Level lessons to verify. Oh, we got the key. Yep. Okay. Got it. Okay. All right. Okay. And the next one here. Tom, go ahead. You have a long one here. Oh, okay. I lost my passport where I was traveling in Morocco. Luckily, the embassy uh, issued me a new one within a few minutes. So I was able to continue my work vacation. Yep, within a few days. Within a few days, okay. Oh yeah, few no days. No problem. No problem. Okay. Uh, Vincenzo, number six. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm a little pressed for time. Mm -hmm. Could we possibly discuss this tomorrow? Yep. Okay. Okay. Good. Uh, the next one. Um, Ahmad, number seven. If you don't pay your bills on time, your credit rating will suffer. Okay. All right, and um, Antonio, go ahead, Antonio. Yes. Uh, they ate uh, two beers, two garden salads, a large pizza, and two cappuccinos. That, I think. Uh, that comes to uh, mm -hmm. 28, uh, 15 pounds, dollars, dollars. Dollars, yep, no problem, no problem. Comes to? Yep, comes to, good, 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 good. And for those of you that are new to, um, that are new to verbling, let me just show you some things here real quick, okay? Good. <laughs> what? Okay, so in here, yeah, you can see what live classes are going on right now. So Eric's is going on. Let's let's inter let's interrupt his uh, class. You guys want to interrupt his class? No, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. But yeah, Eric's <laughs> going on. So you know, so look at him. He's thinking. Hmm. I don't know. The teacher, classroom, students are like what? What's going on? Okay. You can see the other classes coming up. What I'm saying is, I usually put my material here. Okay. All right. So you can look at the material ahead of time. All right. Um, also, too, you can check out. Uh, your recorded classes. So if you participate in a class, then you can listen to yourself. All right. It takes a little while for them to to get posted here. Right. Okay. But this is the last one. Wow, that's great. Look at look at what I have for mine. <laughs> the logo here. But there's a lot of cool teachers. There's also teachers here on the. Um, you can see all our different teachers. You can follow them if you like. Okay. So you can take a look at the teachers, right? Boom, boom, boom. You know, hey, teacher. You can watch all the classes that they had. You can filter by the topic and so forth. Um, also, too, what I keep is uh, on my Facebook. Let me see here. Facebook. Um, yeah. So, so they asked that um, you can see here that I post on here the different uh, things going on in class, okay, like I have a pronunciation class that people ask for. So if you want to check that out, you can keep up to date. And it's, it's not so much that I ask you to like it, but if you like it, then you'll get updates, right? Okay? So you can check out um, what's going on here. That's a good way to also follow the teacher. And there's lots of great teachers here, so you know you just kind of take a look. This one's 719 followers. Like I said, you know, people. Uh, if I was only a beautiful 23-year-old woman, all right, that would that would be kind of weird anyway. If I was, 
So okay, so that's it. That's it for class. Those of you that are new to Verbling, welcome to Verbling. Glad to have you here, okay? So